Hello everyone, this is Collapse, and I'm back yet again playing Craft of Titans. And you can see, I got brand new shiny red armor. Look at it, pretty, it's beautiful. We went and got the Supremium armor, it's good to go. Ooh, what's that weird glitch? Look at that, left side, look at it, I have no idea. Anyway, um, I have it now, it was easy to get. Uh, it has night vision on it, it has, let's see here, this, what's this one have? Uh, this one has absorption. And this one has charm resistance. Charm resistance. It has resistance, not charm resistance. And this one doesn't have anything on it. I want to put wither resistance on this one. Because wither seems to be like the thing I get hit with the absolutely most. So <laughs> I want to have that. The absorption adds a second row of hearts. You see there? I got a second row of hearts there. That's from absorption. But uh, it takes a while for that to come back after it goes away. So it is a thing. We only have resistance one now, but I don't think it's going to be that big an issue. Uh, yeah, so we're good to go. And when I'm here, this is just an area that I was strip miring in early in the game uh, when I was getting our resources, you know, the hard way. But uh, we're going to fight some withers because basically we just need four uh, nether stars and we have creative flight. So I, I, I want to get that done and I want to fight some of these guys and just see how powerful we are because I think we are pretty powerful right now. And I don't think this guy's going to be any any problem at all. Come on. I'm hurting him. I think that glitch is still there. That glitch is still there. That's hilarious. Wow. Okay. Um, yeah, that's, that's how hard a wither is. Um, they're not very hard. <laughs> Uh, the glitch with the dual wield is still there, I see. Um, that add-on that makes it so you can hit, uh, not hit. So you can dual wield, hit with both both weapons. I shouldn't be able to do damage to him right now at all. But for some reason you can. You can damage him early. There we go. Got two, two stars. <laughs> That's kind of funny. You can't do anything to us. Uh, I do need food, though. No, I'm fed up. We just need a couple more. I should be making sure I kill him with which sword, too. Is it this one? Yes, this one has the Fortune 3 on it. I don't need Fortune 3. That what? This one came with Fortune 3. I need looting. What a horrible thing to have on this. <laughs> now that I think of it, I need looting 3. guess it doesn't matter. I just need 4 right now. I'll need more later on. I'll get a proper kill weapon for him. There we go. Need one more. So as you can see, we have our seed now. So, yeah. Not a problem. What am I doing? Do I even know how to wither? There we go. And thankfully, the hardcore wither mod is not in this. So, they are pretty easy. Gonna beat him down. Honestly, the vampires are harder than this guy. <laughs> oh yeah. Stop your stuff. I don't know what's doing that too. I get speed too when I take damage. I have no idea what's giving me that. But it's uh just when I take damage. <laughs> anyway, we'll head back and uh get ourselves some creative flight. Uh, let's go to the Blessed Rock. Go here. Go here. We need, what, four of these? Let's do that. Got a whole bunch of junk on me from fighting down there. Uh, we're going to need... We got the cobblestone. We got the stars. We need these things. We need a bunch of these. I don't know why it's doing this lately. Four, five, six, seven, eight, I want to say. There we go. And that should be 32 diamonds. I think we needed one of these. I think I made one too many of these. That'll give us our angelic ingot. Boom. And boom. We have a blessed rock. And I believe we can fly. <laughs> Just like that. Check that out. Awesome. Boom. Can that be? Oh, it can go into a trinket slot. Any trinket slot, too. That is awesome. Wow, okay. Well, we have creative flight. Just like that, easy peasy. Couldn't be much easier than that. 
Oh, I'm gonna have to open up that. First thing I'm gonna put on that thing is probably Soulbound. <laughs> but yeah, we can just fly around, do as we please, have no worries. And yeah, everything's good in the world. Why are there no enemies around? I don't see nothing. Okay, there's passives. I haven't shown you guys the spell either. Let's check this out. Check it out. <laughs> I got that from one of the loot bags. That thing's insane. Oh, if you do too many of them though. <laughs> Lots of lag. <laughs> but it just destroys things. Okay, now that we are so far ahead, you know, in the armor, in the weapon area, we need to start hammering out some quests, so we should might as well get to that. Get some of that stuff. Ooh, artifact bag. <laughs> Every time I turn around, there's a new artifact bag. What's that? Life? Don't care. <laughs> Throw that in there. There you go. But, uh, yeah, we, we, we need to get some quests, so let's go to the quest. Let's go to fighting back. Actually, you know what? Let's go to the end. Let's go to the end. Let's do that. Uh, at... What is that called? Uh, prefab. I think there's a prefab... For the Ender Pearl. Ender, Ender Portal? Yeah, Ender Portal. Let's check that out. Prefab. Starting house, warehouse, monster, advanced, fish pond, tree farm, produce, co-op, chicken, horse, nether... There's one for the nether. Ender gateway. There we go. How's this one? Let's take a look. Ender gateway. Find out which one. It's not really... doesn't work in JAI very well. Aqua. Advanced. Advanced horse stable. Oh, is the ender gateway? What's it look like? Like a crystal. This one. Ooh, I might not have prismarine blocks. Let's grab two stacks, I guess, and head over here. Do this stuff. And boom. I'm surprised I'm not hearing any mobs. Usually, when it's a blood moon, I at least hear them. <laughs> Where's the rest of it? Did I pick it up? I must have picked it up. Oh, this one takes a ton of power, eh? This one could take a second. There you go. There's our last prismarine block. Let's unload some of this stuff. Because it's just going to get in the way in time. Oh, I don't need that either. Okay. So can we actually make that prefab now? Boom. We're going to have to wait till the blood moon's over. But that's not a big deal. Boom. Okay. Let's go outside. <laughs> go play in a blood moon. Oh. I'm stuck on the ladder. The good thing is, once I get everything soul bound... I don't even need ladders anymore. I can get rid of them. Let's see what's going on outside. Oh, there's mobs everywhere. How you doing, guys? <laughs> it's funny, too, actually. Uh, where are they? Here. These, the charm belt. Because I have that equipped, half of these mobs aren't even paying attention to me. <laughs> um, I have... I made a few of the charms. I kind of forgot. I need... Can I not ride you? There we go. <laughs> Here, so it takes part of that cliff wall out. Preview. Looks fine. I'll just build it. We'll get out of the way, let us do its thing. Try to find the door in this thing. <laughs> I have no clue where the door is. What? <laughs> is there supposed to be a door in this thing? Oh, I don't know how this thing works. I'll have to fill this in with dirt. That'll annoy me. But uh, how, how are you supposed to work this thing? <laughs> is it right here? Yes. That works. Oh, you still need the eyes of Ender. Okay, well we can go make those. That'll only take a second. Uh, but we'll light this thing up, I guess. This one, I gotta say, isn't isn't the most impressive structure. 
The other ones, oh, it's got carpet, so they can't spawn. Okay, that works. But uh, most of the other structures have been pretty impressive. This one, not so much. That's kind of just a giant chocolate egg. Oh, why can't I select my spell? There we go. Yeah, just a giant chocolate egg. <laughs> oh, well, I didn't have to make it. <laughs> Those are Ender Pearls and not Eyes of Ender. This would probably work a lot better. <laughs> there we go. Let's do this. Uh, let's send some of the stuff back. Oh, no. I just... Is that even a thing? I have to go get my pouch. And okay, let's give this a go. Am I the only one that finds it odd that you can put your ender pouch inside of your ender pouch? <laughs> that seems just totally wrong. What did I just fold it inside out? I don't even get it. Anyway, let's go. <laughs> Here we are. See an ender dragon. Wasn't sure how the spawn was going to be. Apparently it's pretty much normal. Shouldn't be a big deal. I don't care. You know what? This is how I feel about these. <laughs> I don't even care. Alright, don't do that. Too busy. There we go. I am uh, fairly overpowered at this point. There we go. Where's he at? If I find you, you're dead. Okay, I guess we're going to use this. Take longer, but easier. He's got a lot of hit points, I'll give him that. That's probably from the difficulty. I mean, we are almost at three bars now. I have to say, this pack, I thought it was going to be super hard. I don't think this pack is even as hard as Forever Stranded, so... Yeah. And I did that pack in hardcore. Come on. Give me all my stuff and things. There we go. What are you mad about? You seem upset about something. <laughs> Give me my heart. Come on now. Stop your spinning. There we go. And we can get some Enderman heads. I never even know if I showed you guys this. It's the uh, weapon I made. It's got Beheading 10 on it. Uh, it's made of Onyx, Mandolin, Mithril, and Invar. You can get Onyx from Dungeons. But that's where I got most of mine. Plus I found a couple of the ores in the Nether. So, not a big deal. I don't even know what those guys are. Must be... Gaia, Gaia, Gaia critters? Yeah, Grimoire of Gaia. They drop anything interesting? Ooh, Ender Dragon Scales. That's a lot of them, too, actually. You get Infinity Agates? Where am I getting Infinity Agates? That makes things really much easier. Huh. Okay. <laughs> I was not expecting that, I have to say. Okay, well, I'm going to stay here for a bit. And I'm going to farm some Enderman heads. I don't know why I'm not getting any. I should be getting them non-stop. This has... Uh... Beheading 10 on it. I've already killed 3. That should be 100%. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to stay here for a bit. See if I can get some Enderman heads. Okay, I have to admit, I'm a little confused here. I need Enderman Skulls for... Because I think I have one, but the soul... There's a couple things that take Enderman heads, so let's go to Enderman. Enderman. Go here, here, go to use. Uh, accepts any item skull, that's fine. Item skull, so this takes an Enderman head. Any skull. Any skull. 
do you just need one? I thought I needed more. I thought one of these logic, one of the uh, slice and spice things took more. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe this is the only one. But even so, even so, none of these mobs are dropping uh, Enderman skulls. I can, nothing. But if I go over here and kill a creeper, so he's got three. There we go. Four, because this is 100%. And these guys, whoa. You need to calm down. Uh, these dragon girls are also considered endermen. And they're not dropping them either. So, I'm not sure how you're supposed to get endermen heads. <laughs> I mean, other than the one I found in a dungeon, I don't know how else you would get them. It just seems a little odd to me. Thought I'd just throw that out there. Okay, we're back, and we're going to work on a couple quests now. Just for funsies. Just to get stuff done. Um... Let's start heading down the line. We, we're so far out of the curve now. I'm not really really concerned about anything. Uh, powered spawner. Powered spawn. There we go. Powered spawner. Or is it right there? We need one of these. Any head. Z logic. I think we already have Z logic. I thought I already made these. Yeah, whatever. Could have swore. Oh, I probably just needed to make the chassis actually. Do that. Do that. Make sure it doesn't use the Enderman, because it's the only one we got. I still find it odd that you can't just get Enderman heads. What does that give us? A Dark Fused. That'd be good if we do a mob farm. Uh, that quest is done. Let's go to Fighting Back. What do I want? A Killer Joe? Don't know if we can do that yet. Oh, why do I keep typing in here? Killer Joe. Boom. Uh, Franken zombie. I think it gave us one. No, it didn't. So we're gonna need a soul binder. So for the soul binder, let's do soul binder. There we go. Boom. And this is the one that needs the skull. So there's that. So that's our one Enderman skull gone. Let's end, let that into the system. Hopefully, we do not need this for anything else. Uh, we'll throw this over by our Ender machines. Boom. We also need a connector. And a wire. Which are probably in my backpack, but I should have a ton anyway. There we go. This wiring stuff up and all this stuff is going to be so much easier now with light. Oh, it's beautiful. There we go. Uh, so that processor what do we need was it the franken zombie yeah it was frank this one here so we need a z logic i don't know if i have another z logic z this is go logic do not have z logic so we're gonna make that first z logic two solarium zombie skull silicon redstone we need shears and axe okay let's do axe doesn't really matter. Uh, shear. We'll just do that. I saw a redstone. Here we go. I don't know if I actually made any solarium. No, I did. Okay. Here we go. But we have the essence anyway. It's not a big deal. What else was there? A zombie skull. There we go. And... Logic. Not logic. There we go. And silicon. Throw that on the ground. Because we're wasteful. Guess we'll go here. And throw that stuff. Oh, that's the soul binder. Why'd I grab the soul binder first when I need the uh, slice and splice? Let's do the slice and splice. <laughs> We need both, but it's not a big deal. I need a couple more solarium, probably. Uh, what do we need? Just chassis? Pretty sweet. I'm glad I made all those extra uh, capacitors. I can tell you that. No, we want this one. Why want to grab the stuff? It's doing one of those things where it's being annoying. 
Actually, I should have kept that, but not a big deal. I need one more of them anyway. There we go. I think I have exactly enough solarium, actually. Uh, I made the right shears. Right one of these. I'll have to make another set. And a skull. Let's just grab a zombie. There we go. Slice this place. Need another connector. And some wires. We're going to have to switch over the flux plug soon anyway. It's not going to be a problem anymore. And make everything wireless. And there we go. Oh, there's our quest. Which quest did it just say we did? Where's that quest? Oh, down here apparently. Claim. Oh, is this a crafting? No. Thank goodness. They split up the quest lines. It's kind of annoying. <laughs> but we're doing two quest lines at once apparently. Vibe and crystal. Bam. Okay. Let's put these ones down. You could really mess up your quest line really easy there. Uh, and have to do stuff again if they were consumed. Thankfully they're not consumed. There we go. So let's go here. We need a skull. Oh, it gave us everything we need. We got a Franken zombie in a Z logic. So we can actually make what we needed. Quest, uh, fight back. Killer Joe, right? Let's grab Killer Joe. Killer Joey. Bam. There we go. There's Killer Joe. Quest. Fighting back. Claim. Which one's that? Sharpness 5 and an Ender. Sharpness 20. Okay. Once we get the disenchantment table, I'm pulling that off and putting it on one of our axes. So that's going right in my system. Did I not actually claim that? I did. Where's my Ender? Right there. Okay. That's going to get used later on. Same as, where are those? Where did I put those? I have another one of those plus 20s. Where are my solarium daggers? They must be downstairs. There's another one. I have two of those anyway, with the 20 on them. Are they in here? No. I don't know. We'll worry about that later. We have two. We basically have two possible books with uh, Sharpness 10XX on it, which is amazing. Um... That we'll be able to disenchant later and take it off. Let's go to here. What's this one? Vacuum chest. Let's see here. Vacuum. Boom. We can just straight up make that. Go here. Detect. Claim. Oh, it needs two of them. Really? Why? For fun. Pulsating crystal. There we go. If it ever decides to do its thing, I just put those in there. Come on now. Might as well keep that on us. There we go. Vacuum chest done. And this is actually a pretty cool one here. With this mob swab. Uh, what is that? A blaze? <laughs> With this mob swab though, you can take that, use that on a mob. Say I want a zombie. I can use the mob swab on a zombie. He'll put his like DNA on it. Um, then you combine the swab with a seed and a bucket of experience and a crafting table. And uh, it'll give you GM chicken feed. So I don't even know what this chicken feed is going to be for. Because usually it is for a mob egg. So I'm curious what this is for. We might actually go test that. Because they obviously gave us one. But it's going to say, Happy Birthday Dark Osto Explode. And give us a chicken egg. Uh, give us an egg. It should anyway. We'll see. Let's go find a chicken real quick. Chicken. If I was a chicken, where would I be? I know I've killed a lot of the chickens. But it shouldn't be too hard. I haven't gone over here a lot. There's a chicken. There he is. Come here. Oh, that one didn't give us... See, it just gave us an egg. Because it's not actually programmed to a mob. But we can do that really easy. Uh, we have a swab. We'll wait. We'll do that. We are going to do that. Because you can use it to uh, change vanilla spawners to other things. So you 
uh, get the, the spawn egg, so of the creature that you want to get by doing that with the chicken. Um, then take the spawn egg, use it on a vanilla spawner, then use a drop of evil, and you get the spawner that you want. So just one of the ways of changing spawners. You end up with a disturbed spawner of the type you want, which is pretty cool. Uh, anyway, you got to see a chicken blow up. That's always fun, right? Uh, you got a farming station. That's an easy one. And that's one I should probably have over by my food anyway at some point. Do we actually have... We don't have this. We have everything else, though. Why does it keep doing this? Stop that. Bam. Oh, it's going to... Why do you keep doing this? Uh, what else? What is that called? It is a chassis. Oh, I made it right here. Electrical steel. Ho. What are these? Pulsatings? I probably don't even have those, do I? I do. I must get those from chest. And electrical. Doing two quest lines at once, because why not? They're all Ender Quest, so uh, Ender IO, I mean. There you go, Quest. Uh, where was that one? Here. Why does it want to make us two? I don't understand why it's doing that. Come on now. Why two? Why? Why? That's just frustrating. Okay, do that. Go away, go away, go away. Go away, go away, go away. Go away. Okay. Uh, just keep making chassis. Just make them forever. Uh, didn't I still have two of those? What? Okay, we'll just make more. You know what? Let's keep that for a second. Oh, I missed it. There we go. Do that, do that. There we go. What else do we need? Nothing. But it's going to be a, a bugger and uh, make us do this. Oh, what was that circuit? That was the Z-Logic. Z-Logic. And some electrical steel. We have two, but we need more. I'll clean up our inventory. Boom, boom. There we go. Another quest done. Detect Supreme Max and Ho Octatics, which are nice. So it's okay that it made me make two, I guess. <laughs> Let's go back to fighting back. Wants us to make auto placers. Why does it want to give us auto placers? Oh, for an auto wither killer, maybe? Placement of Soul Sand and Wither Skulls. Yeah, it's much easier with mechanical users. I would never use the auto placers myself, but anyway. Auto placer. Boom. Boom, boom. Some palace. I guess is all we need. Do we have Restonia? No, we don't. Okay, let's do uh, Redstone. And some Lapis. Head over to this. Holds a swab while we do it. Go here. Ow, oh, you would too. Good enough. Grab those. Do the things. Grab that. Do this. Boom. Let's just grab a bunch of these. We're going to need them later on anyway. Let's keep two on us. Go here. And we should be able to just make two of those. I think it said two, right? Or did it say four of these? Reinforced obsidian. Wither skull heads? Bam. That would have been an easy way to get wither skulls early on. Let's go here. Go to quest. Go to fighting back. What's left? Mob masher. That should be easy. We'll have to set up a mob farm pretty soon. I've been kind of dragging my butt on it. But it's not a big deal. One. Two. Mob masher. Block of... What? How can I... Oh, I probably just don't have a block of iron. Boom. There we go. Let's make a bunch. Let's keep one on us. Grab that. Why does it keep not wanting to grab things? 
Okay. I'm going to have to get on to uh, refined storage pretty soon. Just going to start driving me nuts. Not have, being able to do simple things like that. Need some swords. We have one recipe. Steal another. And we have to redo our recipe again. Wonderful. But I think we got everything else. Yes. So let's do sword. Spikes. Redstone. Diamonds. Let's grab three of these puppies. And what was the last thing? Iron block. That I put right there. Boom. Mob masher. Tell me it only said one. Excellent. Three mob masher upgrades. What is that? The fortune one? Or looting? Yeah. Excellent. That, that one's already done. So all we have here, and there was something stopping us here. Yeah, blood magic. Not getting the blood magic right away. Uh, let's finish off these ones really quick. Go here, quest. Which one's this? Wireless charger? That one's actually useful, I guess. Uh, wireless charger. The hand filler is an item added to actually uh, fill an area of specific block dirt. Oh yeah, this fills an area. I never use the thing. It's messy. Uh, charger? Nope. I've had it do really odd things, so I usually stay away from those things. Boom. It's going to make us use an octatic. And there you go. We need an enderman head. So someone tell me how I'm going to get an enderman head. See, I knew this was going to be a problem. I'm going to have to go and maybe contact Bullyman and ask him how I'm expected to get an Enderman head, because I, at this point, have no clue. Uh, I'm using a weapon that has 100% beheading, and I can't get an Enderman head? I'm not going to wander around dungeons for it. I'm not going to do it. That is bad design. It's probably... I don't know. I don't know what the problem is. I'm not going to say anything. I mean, I'm not. it's not, not his fault, I'm sure. But uh, there's something definitely odd going on there, because I should be able to just get Enderman heads. <laughs> you know what I mean? But anyway, what is this? Blaze, get in there. I don't need you. Okay, so I think I'm going to end this one here. So, as always, if you guys like this video, please hit that like button. If you really liked it, hit that subscribe button. It's much appreciated. And uh, I want you guys all to have a good one, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Later!